y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another try on haul, y'all. So in this video, I have partnered with Cupshe, which we know Cupshe does incredible swimsuits. So I do have a couple of swimsuits, but also this go round I ordered from their like regular clothing section. So I have like this dress. I have some sandals, I have a cover up, I have pool like accessories. I really just got a chance to order uh, from the entire website. So I'm excited to show you everything. I do have a discount code as well. It is YT-FF. That will save you 10% off of a minimum purchase of 70 bucks on their website. So if you like something from this video, it is all linked down below uh, for your shopping pleasure. Hopefully you do find something that you like. I also have a giveaway. So stick around to the end and I'll explain and show you and all that fun stuff. Um, what the giveaway is. I'm excited to partner with Cupshe again because they really do, like I mentioned, great quality swimsuits. But I also ordered from their um, like straight size section. It goes up to an extra, extra large. So I really wanted to give it a go and see if that size range was open for me as well to order things from. So I hope you like this video. Again, I hope you find something you like. Let's do this dress first. Let's get into it. So because you can't see my full body as per usual, I will put a video here of me wearing it. So this dress is a size extra, extra large. It is a gorgeous yellow, like double elastic cinched in, like bat wing sleeve, midi maxi-ish dress. It doesn't come to the ground on me, but it's pretty darn close. And then it's got a couple of slits on the side that sort of help that breathability because it is summertime it is hot outside this fit is absolutely perfect it's everything I could want in a dress it also has really pretty can you see that pattern on the dress so it's not just a flat yellow dress it's got really pretty detail on it the v-neck is a great stopping point on me I just think everything about this is absolutely stunning I Yellow is my color, y'all. If you haven't watched past videos and you don't know, but yellow is my favorite color of life. It's just fun. It's summery. It reminds me of sunshine. I'm such a summer sunshine type gal that this is just so pretty. The cinching in at the waist. Ugh. Spoiler, I've already worn this a couple weekends ago. Maybe last weekend, I feel like at this point, uh, Brian and I went downtown. We live in Mobile, Alabama, but we live pretty far from downtown. But downtown is like the happening spot where, you know, you go to try all the local restaurants and do all the cool, fun things in your town. Um, so we went downtown. I wore this dress, took some really cute pictures. I'll put them here in case you're interested. So I can tell you 100% that this dress is a very wearable dress. It is not see-through. It's breathable. It's breezy. That day, I think we hit a record of like 102 degrees. So it was a very nice, easy, breathable dress. Highly recommend. I actually was super careful like while I ate lunch and stuff. I was so afraid that I was going to spill something on it. And I still hadn't shown it to you yet in a video. But this one, super pretty. And with this dress, I wore these really cute sandals. So these are Cupshe brand sandals. I believe I got them in a size 10. I'm anywhere from like a 9 to a 10 just depending on style and that sort of thing. So if, when I'm trying a brand that I've never tried shoes before, I'll typically always size up to a 10. Good call on these. They do have a tad bit of extra room at the bottom, like a little bit of length that my foot doesn't cover. But I think had I sized to the 9, they would have been, they would have looked too small on me. So these are a beautiful like tan camely color. This right here is actually like a stretchable leather feel. So my foot was able to slide in there really easy. I wore these all day long. You can tell by the back of them. Um, we walked around downtown. Like I mentioned, we had lunch. We went and saw a mummy exhibit at the museum. We did all sorts of things and these were super comfortable. Um, I didn't feel like I needed to stretch them out first for them to be comfortable. I just like them and they're really, really cute. While we're doing shoes, let's also do these. So these sort of like style shoes are really coming back if they haven't come back already. They're like the clear 
like not gel, like jelly detail, but just this clear band is super popular right now. Here's a close up of them as well. They're this really cute mint green, like cushion detail. They're also in a size 10. They have the gold detail across the clear part. And then I just realized like two nights ago, I was getting all this stuff together to show you. It's hands. <laughs> it's like hands holding the gold detail. So these, while again, they are a size 10, they do fit me a little bit more snug. Like this clear part here is not as stretchy. My foot will fit in it. So I have no issue wearing them. I just, I haven't worn them yet to figure out if that stretches enough to be a little bit more comfortable. So keep that in mind that these have a minimal stretch. I can just always use a new pair of sandals. I feel like I gravitate towards sort of the same style of sandal, which is like a thong style, like nude color, like a beigey nude for me. Just like nothing really fancy. They're just basic sandals. These and like the other tan ones are just so cute that I felt like I needed to give them a go. And there's the cushion. You can see it's like actual cushion. Next item we have is a t-shirt dress. That's what they call it on the website. Also in a size extra, extra large. It is a little bit more oversized on the model on the website. On me, it's quite a bit fitted, I feel like, or it fits me sort of like a button down tunic. It's also a tad bit short for me. So I would probably wear this one as a swimsuit cover up. It does actually fit me pretty well buttoned up. I'm not getting like any gaping or anything like that. Um, it's really fun. Like the pattern is almost like fall feeling, but I think it's sort of like tropical as well. It is a collared like proper button up. It has these really cute ties on the sleeves. The color pattern of it is really fun. I just think like I mentioned, it's a little bit too short for me to wear as an actual dress. But like I also mentioned on the website, the model, it was more oversized than longer and just a really cute t-shirt button up style dress. And it's almost that perfect material to be a cover up. Like it's not a thick button up dressy feeling. Again, from the straight size sections while it, section, while it is an extra, extra large, it does fit me. So that opens up so many more doors for me on uh, Cup Shoes website. I'm a size 20 or a 22 for reference if you didn't know that already. Um, so I feel like most of their extra, extra large items are probably either like 18, 20, 22 type feel. You've just got to read the measurements. Let's do the swimsuits now. These are not uh, from the straight size section. This is a two piece, top and bottom are both. Nope, top is in a 2X, bottom is in a 3X. I like that I could pick different sizes for the top and the bottom because for the top, I typically want them a little bit tighter because I want to make sure that I am in the swimsuit. Whereas the bottom, I am a little bit wider on the bottom. So I need that extra space down there. So this one is a really pretty black two piece with this red floral detail on it. The top is super comfortable. I love the thicker straps. It does have sewn in padding and then the back which you've either already seen or you will see is like one of those hook closures, which is really nice. Now the bottom is one of those styles that's super in right now. It sort of comes to the V in the front. We know I don't love things below the belly button, um, but I know that some people do. So when I see things like this, while I may not wear it for the most part, like out of my backyard. I know that some people really, really like this style. So I always want to show you. Um, I like this one. I think that this was the right size for me. I have no complaints. The top fits really, really nice. And this is the other swimsuit that I have. So again, video here. This one's in a size 2X. Anytime that I see things that are lower cut, I size down because I feel like for my personal preference, I want it a little bit tighter just to make sure that I have no issues with anything being seen. So this one, I've tried on several of the mixed print or mixed pattern ones in the past and y'all seem to really like them. So I thought this blue one would be a good option to show you. So it's in a size 2X, striped top, blue band here, tropical bottom. I am wearing my own like underwear underneath it. So if you see the lines, that's what it is. Um, this one is sort of a different take on 
a tropical swimsuit, I feel like, with the light blues. It's very florally versus tropical, but then the stripes, I feel like, make it obviously it's a swimsuit you know what I mean but it just makes it more like beach vibes in my opinion so this one does have padding that you can remove so if you like that sort of thing there you go and then I just tied it in the front and then put it over my head so it's a tad bit tight um, on me but but then again also I would rather it be tight than not and then I want to show you what it looks like with this on because you know I mentioned that this would be a cute swimsuit cover up. Yeah, it's like the perfect little button up. Okay, two things left, but they're like pool accessories. So I felt like showing you while I'm wearing a swimsuit would be nice. So they have what they call like beach or pool blankets versus a towel. And they have so many different patterns of them. So it's microfiber, 80% polyester, 20% polyamide. Polyamide is what it says. Okay, so obviously I chose this leopard print so it is the size of like a regular beach towel but it's that different feel and it's meant more for um like to lay on the sand sort of thing it's not towel material the back is just a plain like peachy color but i really really like this and like i mentioned they had so i'm trying to show you there we go they had so many different prints of this that i thought it would be nice to lay on um, like a hot chair out back by my pool and then you've still got your regular beach towel uh, for when you get wet or you swim or whatever so these I thought were really nice and I've never owned like a beach blanket before always we used to just take like sheets from our house when I was younger to the beach um, and then as an adult I just took a bunch of towels but this is a nice you know a nice option when you don't want to take 10 beach towels you have this that's sort of your base for everything. They also have floaties, y'all. They had several, if I'm remembering correctly. So I opted for the heart shape, and then obviously I got the blue one. It's called Love Feather. Oh, there's feathers in it. Swimming ring, summer starts here. You can see the actual feathers in it. I thought that we would blow it up together. I do have a machine, like, somewhere. Should I go get that? I feel like maybe we should. Okay, hang on. Okay, we're back. I do have, like, an actual pool floaty blower up thingy but I separated it and it really is a heart wait there we go is that it yeah okay so let's blow it up I'm pretty sure this machine's pretty loud from what I remember so I'll speed it up and turn down the volume so that you're not wow did you just see me put that in the wrong spot um so that you're not hearing it the whole time Okay, I took the like cover up off because I felt like it ruined my vibe because everything's blue. So here we go. This is what it looks like. I had big plans to like show you in the pool and like take all these like fun pictures with it and then with the like beach blanket and stuff, but it's a monsoon outside today. So <laughs> they had several colors of these like you saw on the little card that I showed you. Also, they have a ton of other floaties, like not just these like feather heart shaped ones. There's the feathers in there. They're actual blue feathers. But I thought this was fun. This will make up for the one that we just lost in the storm. Out back. Okay, so you have seen everything that I can try on, blow up, and show you. So again, it's all linked down below. So now let's do the giveaway. I also ordered this stunning one shoulder tropical dress. I'll put a picture on the screen what it looks like. It's also in a size extra extra large and it fits my body. It's just snug. It doesn't like I wouldn't wear it out of the house. I feel like this is probably more of a size like 16, 18, but it's got an elastic waistband, this little ruffle at the bottom. Again, the one shoulder with the ruffle. This is elastic. It is the most Taryn summer dress if there ever was one but unfortunately it just doesn't fit me so what I'm going to do is give it away there's no sense in it sitting at my house because I can't wear it so all I want you to do is like this video and then comment down below your favorite piece that I tried on or that I blew up or that I showed you 
um, from this video and you're automatically entered to win. I will choose one person. I will ship this to you from me to you. So I feel like that's the best option instead of just letting it sit at my house like I mentioned. I feel like one of y'all would love this and look so cute in it. So again, comment down below your favorite thing that I showed you from this video um, and like this video. I'll also link this dress down below in case you want to just go ahead and grab it for yourself because it is such it's such a pretty dress. So let's wrap it up now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. As I mentioned, everything is linked down below. I do have a discount code as well. Be sure to use it if you are purchasing. Thank you to Cupshe once again for partnering with me and allowing me to pick all these items. Um, and I hope that you had a good time. I had fun. Probably blowing up that floaty was... <laughs> was the highlight for me. It's just so cute. And hopefully the sun will come out a little bit later and I can head out there and just take some cute pics and stuff with it. So thanks for watching again and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.